First of the night team tonight, Hotel Horrors. This Motel 6 on Jefferson Boulevard in Warwick back in the news again tonight. In the past year, we have covered this local motel for a standoff, a meth lab, and now sex trafficking. And we are now digging deeper into that motel and the problems that it has been facing, starting with the most recent. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Patrice Wood. I'm Dan Janey. Detectives rescued the female team by going undercover as Johns. The 19's Matt Reed joins us now with the latest from there. Patrice, Dan, the 17-year-old ran away from the Massachusetts Department of Families and Children's just a week ago today, and days later, she ended up here at the Motel 6 off Jefferson Boulevard with pictures of her online saying she was willing to show you a good time. Our detectives were able to contact her uh, via uh, back page, and in doing so, they made arrangements to meet her at the Motel 6 in Warwick. Major Kevin O'Brien of the Rhode Island State Police say when detectives arrived at this Motel 6 Friday afternoon, they found the 17-year-old teen and 21-year-old Adolfo Hernandez of Mattapan, Massachusetts inside the room. The undercover detectives arrested Hernandez for possession of crack cocaine and sex trafficking of a minor. He reached out for her and they made a connection on the social media site and then uh, he pursued her over the site and eventually they made arrangements to meet. Major O'Brien says it's unknown how long the two were allegedly working out of the Warwick Motel 6, but Friday's arrest comes less than a week after police busted a meth lab operation being run out of the same Motel 6. Major O'Brien believes the motel's location near the highway could be attracting criminals. Certainly the most important is the ease uh, of getting on and off the highway. Uh, you know, you can uh, check into a, one of those hotels fairly quickly and, and get out of there fairly quickly. Now we reached out to Warwick PD about this increase of crime recently. They said they've increased patrols in the area and they're keeping a special eye out for these hot spots of crime. Reporting tonight in Warwick, Matt Reed, NBC 10 News Night Team.